Hello everyone, my name is Cameron and welcome back to the channel and today I want to talk to you guys a bit about something that I kind of uh, brought up on the channel last, sometime last year, around Mayish, when I first started working where I'm currently working. And that was a gaming PC. I've talked heavily over the years that I don't prefer any system. I just enjoy gaming as a whole. It doesn't matter what I'm gaming on. A true gamer knows that no matter the system, no matter what you're playing on, video gaming is gaming. It's a passion that we all share, that we all love. I've never been someone who's said, oh, this is better than this, or this is better than this. I've never been that type of person. I heavily enjoy gaming no matter the system. There's games I love that are on certain systems and that are not on other systems. And now that I have an Xbox One and a PS4, I get to enjoy games like Sunset Overdrive, State of the K2, Halo, and other things that are exclusive to Xbox. On PlayStation, I get to enjoy games like Days Gone and God of War and Infamous. I love the Infamous series. And Uncharted and the last of us, I could go on and on about exclusives, but that's not why I'm here to talk about this. I'm here to talk about PC. Now, for those of you who are wondering, whatever happened with the gaming PC situation? Why do I not have gaming PC stuff on the channel? Why have I not shown it off? I haven't built it. So, for those of you who don't realize, life gets in the way of plans. Uh, you will plan something, and then life will get in the way. For me, life got in the way with actually buying food and a bunch of other stuff. I actually had to do a lot more once my new job came along because rent went up and a lot of things changed. So bills changed, the way they were being paid was being changed a bit. So we were trying to kind of budget everything into a situation where it was fitting for both me and my mom, where we weren't screwing ourselves over completely with money. And that was a big thing, was that happened. And then I bought my crossbow, which I'm still not technically done with because I still have to pay, finish and pay for my crossbow bolts. Um, and that was a big thing is I just, life got in the way of everything and a lot of things happened that made it to where I couldn't exactly just build the PC. However, that being said, I do still plan on doing a gaming PC. Now I want to quickly talk about this. Okay. I do not plan to full on build one and have that be what I start gaming on, on my PC. Instead, I'm going to buy a current gaming PC. There's actually a pretty nice desktop tower, not too expensive, on Amazon that I currently have in a list, uh, along with actual parts for PCs that I will be buying later on in the future to build one. A gaming chair and a big corner desk that will house this system. And I really quick want to say, when they both, when everything's here, when you know the desktop gets here and when I start building it, I will show you guys everything. I may not be the best at building a PC. This is going to be my first time trying to do it. Uh, but I wanted to get something to start with and I'm getting, let me just clarify, I'm not using the case that I'm buying. The tower I'm buying is going to stay how it is. It's not going to be changed in any way, shape or form. Um, it is just going to be there as one for me to start with and to have so I can get some gaming PC stuff on here and so I can start working on a mod pack for me and Dalton play on Minecraft when he eventually gets his gaming PC. However, we don't know when that's going to be happening because some things are happening that I'll get to in a minute. So I do plan to do this. I also plan to get an actual camera and stop using my phone for this. So <laughs> rejoice. <laughs> um, but I plan to get an actual tower that I'll just use for the time being. And then when I build mine, the tower I'm using for gaming at the time will be changed. And instead of using that for my game, for my gaming, that will be used to edit, specifically edit videos for the channel. Um, the other one that I build, which again, I will unbox every piece as it gets here. I have them all on the list as well. That, however, will be done and then be used for gaming. It's going to be built around what me and Dalton are going to need it for at the time, uh, which is mostly modded Minecraft. And before people say, oh, you're spending all this money for a PC for modded Minecraft, you've obviously never played modded Minecraft. I have a pretty beefy computer upstairs. It's not a gaming computer in any right, but it was still a pretty beefy computer back when I ha it still worked. That thing could barely run Minecraft when it was modded, modded Minecraft, I should say. Also, Minecraft just needs a whole lot of RAM no matter what. Exploring the world and all that takes up a lot of storage space. So if you don't have something that has a lot of RAM, there's not much you can do to keep it. Um, which is why initially when I wanted to get a gaming laptop like six or so years ago, my dad ended up instead deciding to get a better uh, like actual computer from 
think Retina Center is where we got it from. It was a nice touch screen computer. It was awesome. For those of you wondering, what will I be doing with this? What will be going on the channel when I get this? I'm not sure yet. I don't personally know. Um, I definitely want to do Minecraft stuff. And I definitely want to have it be nicer, cleaner videos from the PS4 and if I decide to do stuff from the Xbox, from the Xbox as well. Uh, my big plan is I'm going to try to work this out in the best way where it's fitting for me and for you guys when I'm actually doing all this stuff. The best thing I can say that's going to come from this is you guys are going to get cleaner, edited content. You guys are going to get intros, outros, awesome things put on the channel because I'm going to be able to do a lot more if I have a better PC. That being said, I don't know when this is all going to happen. Um, for starters, my PC build is going to take some time. Uh, I'm going to buy everything I want to buy, you know, start getting everything bought and, and shipped here and brought here uh, to my house, whether it's this house I'm currently at or the new house I'm going to be moving to whenever I move there. Um, <laughs> and then everything will be set up in the way I want it to be. Uh, the situation, the hope for this is that within the next year I can have a nice beefy gaming computer as well as a nice computer just to kind of hold my system or to hold videos and stuff. Uh, that being said, uh, the computer I plan on buying does have a three year warranty. Also, I'm going to at some point upgrade that so that way it has more storage space. So that way the uh, videos can be stored more. More videos can be stored basically. So that way if I have things that need to be backlogged, if I go on a trip or something, I have them. And the best part about this is I can take the PC setup with me. I can take both of them with me and I can go off somewhere. If I go on vacation or something, I can take those with me and that way I can still upload them. Or if worst case scenario, I need to, you know, I'm traveling lighter because I'm flying or something, I can just get a beefier laptop, a gaming style laptop, not using my computer, or the laptop I currently have, which is just like an HP school laptop, and use that to store videos as well. I can move the videos from one to the other, have enough storage, have a computer that's beefy enough to hold all those videos without it slowing down, and then go out and upload them while I'm on vacation. So it means I won't be shy about going somewhere. I won't be like, oh, sorry, man, I got to do this and this and this and this or something, you know, or, oh, man, my channel can't slack because it's hard to get noticed on YouTube these days. It means that when I'm on vacation, I don't have to take a break from the channel because personally, while I want to be able to enjoy vacation, I also don't really want to be stuck in a situation where my channel is suffering because I'm not there. However, there is so much content on my channel, I'm pretty sure even if I took like a month long break, I could come back and there'd still be people watching stuff because I have enough content on the channel for that to be possible. <laughs> now, that also being said, uh, I mentioned a mod pack um, earlier. Now, this is a mod pack me and Dalton have kind of been working on for like the last year and a half. We've been kind of compiling mods that we won't put in there. Currently, we have 85. That's probably, probably going to be shrunken down at some point because there's a lot of mods in there that probably do the exact same thing as another mod that's already in there. Basically, we've just wanted to get a list of mods together that we want to do. For that, I'm asking you guys, if you play modded Minecraft or you watch someone who plays modded Minecraft and they have cool mods in their mod pack, leave some suggestions. Whether it be here on my Twitter, on my Facebook, or on my Instagram, I can't promise that I'll see everything if you guys go post it there. Uh, if you guys need any of my social medias, they are in the banner on the channel including my Twitch, go follow Twitch. Uh, I will be doing Xbox live streams uh, of State of Decay 2, Sunset Overdrive, and probably many, many other games when I actually can get the time. Uh, so yeah, go follow, my, go follow my Twitch and my other social medias. <laughs> Shameless plug. <laughs> I need to. It's something that needs to be done. A lot of people don't realize about all the stuff that actually goes, that's actually linked to this channel. They don't realize there's actually more than just the channel itself. Uh, Twitter especially because Twitter is where I'll go to update you guys the most on if anything is changing with a schedule of something or a video or a recording of something like that. It's also where if I can actually remember to do it on Sundays before I leave to work where I'll put any predictions for WWE shows uh, or any other wrestling shows that are happening. Uh, and I also want to mention Dalton really quick because I mentioned him a little bit earlier. If you guys don't know who Dalton is, he is probably the best friend I have right now. Uh, we play video games together basically constantly. It, it, I think he's about the solid, most solid person I've played video games with over the last... Fuck, I, was, I think I was like a sophomore when I met him. Um, so it's been... Shit, that was, what was my sophomore year? 
<laughs> when was my sophomore year? Let's see, 2016, 2015. Like 2013, 2014, somewhere around there is when I met Dalton, I'm pretty sure. So about the last six years, uh, five, six years, we've, we've known each other. Um, if you guys don't know the whole story of how me and him became friends, uh, we met playing a game of Civ. We ended up actually kind of, we, we both like at the end of the game, we're like, hey man, solid playing. I think his team won. I said, hey man, solid playing. You're pretty good at this game. And then we became friends. Uh, and then we played more games together. We put, that's actually where we found a shared love of Minecraft, where we started playing that together. Uh, we played Civ together constantly. We still play Civ together constantly. Uh, same with Minecraft, but that's more sporadic at the moment. Um, we play constant, we play tons of games together. If there's any game that one of us is interested in and we see it and we're like, oh, hey, dude, get this game. Um, we'll typically hop on the game together uh, and play uh, with each, play the game with each other. Um, like Portal Knights or Fortnite and stuff like that. It's just, it's a lot of fun to be able to have someone to game with constantly. However, the PC stuff is kind of a difficult thing for him as he doesn't have a job right now. Uh, so <laughs> he won't exactly be getting the PC around the same time I will. He's actually probably the thinking is he's going to build the PC himself. Dalton's going to college soon. He's actually being looked at to play D division three football at a school. I want to say, I want to say it's in Illinois. I could be wrong. It might not be a school in Illinois. Um, but he's getting tapped to play division three football, which is a big, big thing for him. That's really cool. That's always kind of what he's wanted to go to. Well, he, that's not what he wants to go to school for, but he's happy that he's able to go to school because of football and he's getting a sort of scholarship. I say sort of because the school he's going to doesn't actually offer division three schools aren't allowed to offer sports scholarships. They can only offer academic, which technically he kind of, I thought he kind of got one, but it's a weird situation. They can only offer academic or even funnier gaming scholarships, which I wouldn't expect but it's only PC gaming, so he can't uh, go there uh, for that, <laughs> which means he's going to have to be spending a lot of money. And it's like, even if he lives on campus, it's like 31000 a year or something like that. So it's really expensive, and he's not going to exactly be able to just outright buy a gaming computer from the get-go like I will be able to. I have a job. I also do go to school, but it's a different situation right now. Mine's online, and mine's cheaper because of just situations. I'm not going to get into that. It's it's kind of like a, a family sort of situation type thing. Um, but it means I don't really have to pay for my school in the same way he does. Uh, but the big thing is that he's not going to be able to do that. So instead, I told him, dude, just build yours over time. Just build one over time. So there's a list on our my Amazon account, which I have shared with him. So that way, not my Amazon account, but like I've shared the list with him. So he can also go check the list. And if he wants to buy the same things I'm buying, which is kind of the situation we're going for, he can add it to his cart and then buy it. And the reason I told him, dude, just work on that is because I don't know what I want to do with the mod pack just yet. And I want to have some time to build it. Hopefully within like the next year, year and a half, both of us have a good gaming PC and we can kind of bring some cool mod of Minecraft to the channel. I'm making no promises. <laughs> no promises whatsoever um, about that being a thing that's going to happen because I don't really know if it's going to be a thing that happens anytime soon. It, it's a situation where it's kind of like, okay, this could happen, this could not happen. Um, hopefully, hopefully we can get to the point where it's kind of being done in a fun way where both of us get to enjoy the time playing a game on a cool gaming PC. Obviously, within the next year, he'll have a job too as well. So, yeah, he'll be able to hopefully buy the parts a little bit easier. Uh, if you guys want to know what me or Dalton are going to school for, if you do, I guess. I think, if I remember correctly, he said he's going for engineering, which is kind of always what he's wanted to do. Uh, he's going to, I think, do a minor in computer engineering sort of stuff. So that way... Both of us know what we're doing a little bit better. I am going for business. This opens up some opportunities for me and Dalton. Uh, so if you guys don't know, I'm, man, this is a real weird tangent about me and Dalton's friendship. But hey, it fits because let's be honest, if it wasn't, I think Dalton's also been a big supporter of this channel since I started it. He gets a little bit pissy when I'm not gaming and <laughs> when I'm playing, recording something, I can't game exactly at the time. But still, he's been an awesome supporter of the channel. Um, I think since day one. I think since even before I started doing daily content, he was a big supporter of the channel, which was really awesome. Um, but yeah, so if you guys don't know, Dalton lives in Illinois, Springfield, Illinois, to be exact. I live in Michigan. I'm not saying exactly which city I live City, uh, I think I've said it enough times, but I live in Howard City, Michigan. That's going to be changing soon. Um, but <laughs> we both live kind of in 
you know, the northern Midwest area, uh, both in cold climates, which fucking suck 90% of the time. And both of us hate each other when it comes to football because he's a Chicago Bears fan. I'm a Green Bay Packers fan, which for those of you who are like, but don't you live in Michigan? Yes, but I actually like teams that are good. Uh, no, I was raised as a Packers fan and I'm still a Packers fan to this day. It, it stuck. <laughs> uh, I was my dad side of the, my dad raised me as a Packers fan. My mom's side of the family tried to raise me as a Lions fan, and I chose the Packers. Uh, but yeah, so we always have a massive football rivalry. Um, but we've talked about it. And we're like, dude, if we can ever find a way where both of us can kind of get into a situation where we're next to each other, and we're actually in the same state and stuff, it'd be really cool. Uh, and a big thing with that is if we could potentially get our own business going together, because again. You guys, if you've watched this channel long enough, know I have a passion for gaming and a passion for a lot of things, and I really want to be in gaming. Is That's what I want to do is my career, is something related to gaming, whether it's making gaming PCs or games in general. It'd be awesome to be able to go into that field of work because I'm someone who has had my life molded and shaped in such a way by games. And I talked to Dalton, I'm like, dude, you go into engineering, with minor in computer engineering, meaning you could basically make gaming PC type shit. I go into business, we could start a business together and we realized that today and that's something that's really cool for us because we're like, fuck man, that sounds awesome. <laughs> like b having a business with my best friend would be awesome. Um, especially since it'd be something we'd both love. Again, gaming is a thing we've both been shaped by our whole lives. Uh, and being able to make video games, being able to make video game, uh, Hardware, there we go, that's the word I'm looking for, would be awesome. Uh, so I want to give you guys an update. This is kind of an update uh, on the gaming PC situation and all that. I figured it went off on a weird tangent about me and Dalton's friendship, but continuing. Uh, <laughs> the gaming PC situation, I still plan on building one. I still plan on bringing PC gaming stuff to the channel. And hopefully within the next year, uh, some Nintendo Switch gaming too. Hopefully. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys think about the potential of gaming on PC stuff on this channel, uh, as well as Nintendo Switch stuff, and if there's anything, any mods or anything like that that you guys want me to potentially add to a mod pack. If I already have it, I will let you guys know. If not, I'll say thanks for the suggestion, I'll go check the mod out, and then I'll make my decision. I'm not looking for you guys to, oh, you need to put this mod in there, I'm saying, give me a suggestion, I'll think about it, I'll see if it's something that fits with what me and Dalton want to do with the game. If not, so be it. Uh, we are specifically looking for a weather mod. We want to see if there's any cool weather mods out there that uh, could be enjoyable. We know there's one from uh, Ultra Modded Revival that Captain Sparkles and Zine are doing right now uh, that looks pretty interesting, but we're not sure if that's something we still want to add into our mod pack or not. Uh, and we're going to let you guys know. We have a hell of a lot of mods. If you guys want to know the full mod list, again, let me know down in the comments below, and I'll tell you the current lineup of mods we have in there um and if we're gonna change it in any way we might we might change it again obviously we have a plan to change it we're not sure if we're going to we're gonna add more we're gonna take some away potentially yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed stay golden peace